got a news alert for you now. I want to give you a heads up that a sanctuary county has now been hit with a horrifying, what they're calling, quote, end times type of disease. This is according to the Conservative Tribune. They report that as the liberal outrage over President Donald Trump's temporary ban on immigrants from some countries continues, one of the devastating effects of allowing unvetted immigrants cross borders appeared in one of America's largest sanctuary areas for illegal immigrants, Los Angeles County, California. According to the Los Angeles Times, the report that the L.A. County health officials announced on Tuesday that a resident who died last year had been infected with a bacteria that was resistant to treatment even by the last resort antibiotic uh, colistin because it carried the MCR1 gene. They report that the rise of drug-resistant bacteria is a serious problem as it has led to strains of tuberculosis and gonorrhea that do not respond to antibiotics, according to the Times. They say that the MCR1 gene was first discovered in a female patient in Pennsylvania who had a urinary tract infection in November of 2015, setting off a worldwide bio-risk warning from the World Health Organization, according to Breitbart. Uh, they say here that the Los Angeles County Health Alert Network released a health advisory Tuesday stating that the infection was most likely acquired during international travel. The warning noted that the MCR1 gene, quote, has been reported in human specimens from five additional states and in animal specimens from two states. They report that the Los Angeles County uh, Health Public Health Department recommended hospital-based health providers in California follow the county's Department of Public Health recommendations regarding infection control and testing. All county health care facilities are required to report any signs of MCR1 within one working day. So, um, this is a, I don't know why they're calling it the, the end times type of a disease, but I guess it's because it's, it's resistant to any type of um, drug. Uh, they're right here that the National Geographic reported that MCR1 is resistant to drugs because of mobile genetic elements known as plasmids, which can move from one bacterial spe species to another. Uh, they state this is bad news for everyone, and it presents the country with a problem that needs to be addressed sooner rather than later. They report ins ensuring that immigrants are healthy before allowing them to enter the country would be a step in the right direction. So what do you think about this new deadly bio-risk? Comment below. Subscribe for updates. If you like what we're doing here, give us a thumbs up and explore the links in our description. I'll see you at the next report. For the Next News Network, I'm Gary Franchi. Real quick, before you go, I want to remind you to go to your app store on iPhone or Android and get the Candid app. Join me over there to have some spirited, political, open discussion, honest discussion, anonymous discussion outside of the prying algorithms and the censoring algorithms of Facebook and Twitter. Go to the App Store, grab the Candid app from Google Play or Android or, or iPhone, and um, join the Next News Network group or the News Alert group, and let's make the news great again. I'll see you at the Candid app. You possess the power to impact the global narrative. Please share this report, and to get more videos like this, become a Next News subscriber by clicking the link below. Thank you for watching, The Next News Network.